someone started to fight. Did you know something about directions to go in Directions. What the hell are you? <laughs> Mr. Gun? Fuck fucking hell. What's up, survivors? My name is... <sighs> Hello and what's up, survivors? My name is Sam and we are playing some more Fallout 4. I didn't record in last time that much because basically, as you can see, I was building something. If some of you are wondering how I was able to build this in short time, I really put it much time and effort in it, just running around stupidly scavenging every location of those things which I discovered till now, without really going further into quest. And I recorded most of it, but I started to feel like it is freaking boring to show basically how I'm running around like a Minecraft and scavenging thing because most of you which want to watch something like Minecraft are watching Minecraft and so I won't need to present to you the Minecraft version of Fallout 4. We have to kill right now some stupid stupid little guys. I also upgraded my stuff as you see it has now these um, reflex set or the uh, it's really nice, or is it the night side? No, it's the normal side, the reflex side, and the real stock, the full stock, so that I can normally shoot it like a real gun, not anymore with this shitty aiming. Okay, over there's the... I can't remember what it was actually, but... There are enemies which we have to kill, and for this we will get from some um, other the settlers some things. Oh, a big cow. Can I send you to my colony? What are you doing? Uh, your cow looks... looks nice. <coughs> so what's your story? Looking to trade? Rob me? Or just ask directions to Diamond City? Mm, should I threaten her? Sarcastic. Just looking for love, sweetheart. <laughs> Boy, have you come to the wrong place. My loving days have long since passed. But I'll tell you what, wise ass. You made an old girl smile, and that ain't easy. You wanna do some trading? I'll give you a discount. Mm, fucking hell yeah! Um, someone started to fight. Did you know something about directions to down in Sydney? Directions. What the hell are you? <laughs> Mr. Gun? Fuck fucking hell. We're talking to someone. And this fuckhead comes along. For who is this fire? Can I burn someone? Oh, I can feel the temperature. What is this place? Is this already Diamond City? Can't be. Some sort of smaller city, Lexington. Oh, this leads me to believe that here is the place. Okay. Oh fuck! Not good. Not good. Not good. Not good. Not good. I am running. What the hell? Great. And I thought, yes, yeah, survivors, they help each other. No. Fuck no. 
There is electricity inside that main serious barricade, so this fucker went somewhere to fuck with you. Um, not in that way. Oh god. Sneaked into the into that factory. Oof. Dog meat. Oh, 
grognak. And now I will let the robot. of the cars are queen. Oh my god, it's young. Finally kill him. Finally kill who? Me? Ah, found your sorry ass. <laughs> hey guy. <laughs> Can I tell you something? You're dead. We don't want to know. Authorization arcs, Pharaoh 95. Our unit has sustained casualties and we're running low on supplies. We're requesting okay, support or evac from our position at Cambridge Police Station. I hear gunfire. Automated okay. message repeating. Let's. Why is it not? Okay. There's something walking. Let's get to the polar station. Very good. Oh god, I... What is this music right now? Do I have ammunition for the fat man? Ah, Where's the... Back into the corner it is! Get away you fools! God no! Then I'm in a corner! He will gang rape me or something! I 
go back into my corner or to this platform. <coughs> Interrogate. Hey, I'm on your side. I just need you to tell me the truth. Then maybe I can help. I'm telling you, I'm not a sin. You have to believe me. Hmm. Let's all just calm down. No one has to die. No, right. he wants me dead. He's never going to stop. I have to kill. Don't listen to him. It'll say anything to convince you. Put the Look, gun. all I need is for you to put down the gun. Then we can talk this through. No. No. You'll kill us both. How did Why don't you just tell me how this happened? How this happened? Fine. I was uh, on my way to Bunker Hill. I round a bend, and I see this guy. Me. Gun drawn. Ready to fire. After that, it's a, it's a blur. We scuffled for a while, but I won. Now, I don't know what else I can say to convince you. He's the sin. No. The guy I'm with the gun. Get out of my way. Hmm. You won't be doing anything if I take you down first. Oh, thank God. Damn it, I'll kill you both! Oh, no. Oh, God, what did I do? I hope I made the right choice. But this music in the background. What a beautiful music for a shootout. Huh. Razor grain. My kids, you don't have to grow up orphans thanks to you. <clears throat> Thank God you showed up when you did. I think that thing was really gonna do it. I think they were twins. Weird. Why can't shut off this limb? Should I shoot him? What you know what? Oh god, I made the wrong call. He was the sin. You always know after you shot over. Appreciate the assistance, civilian. But what's your business here? Um, 
Oh, the Brotherhood of Steel. Before I answer, will you tell me who you are? In due time. If you want to remain in our compound, I suggest you answer my question first. I did not say shit. Test I exterminator. I heard you had a feral problem. Evading my questions is a surefire way of getting yourself ejected from the compound. Are you from a local settlement? Uh... I'm from Vault 111. You're a vault dweller? Most people wouldn't admit to such a thing. I appreciate your honesty. If I appear suspicious, it's because our mission here has been difficult. Uh -huh, Since the moment we arrived in the Commonwealth, we've been constantly under fire. If you want to continue pitching in, we could use an extra gun on our side. That all depends. How much are you paying? We need allies, not opportunistic mercenaries. I have no inclination to pay for your services. Hmm. I want to help, but I don't like the secrecy. Who are you, really? Very well. I'm Paladin Dance, Brotherhood of Steel. Paladin. Over there is Scribe Halen and Knight Reese. We're on recon duty, but I'm down a man and our supplies are running low. I've been trying to send a distress call to my superiors, but the signal's too weak to reach them. Sir, if I may... Proceed, Aelin. I've modified the radio tower on the roof of the police station, but I'm afraid it just isn't enough. What we need is something that will boost the signal. Our target is ArcJet Systems, and it contains the technology we need, the deep-range transmitter. We infiltrate the facility, secure the transmitter, mm -hmm. and bring it back here. Oh. So what do you say? You willing to lend the Brotherhood of Steel a hand? Maybe. Who are the Brotherhood of Steel? Our order seeks to understand the nature of technology. Its power. Its meaning to us as humans. And we fight to secure that power from those who would abuse it. Okay. Your cause seems noble. I'm pleased that you agree. There are very few outside the Brotherhood who appreciate the gravity of the situation we're facing as a species. So, what do you I say? I need that technology. Will you help us? No, no this time not. Let's get moving. Outstanding. There shouldn't be any exterior security, so we'll head into the front. But why won't the vault dwellers? Okay. Jet systems facility. I bet there will be such a shit ton of enemies that it will be not nice. Here's it was place. corporations like this that put the last nail in the coffin for mankind. They exploited technology for their own gains, pocketing the cash. Ignoring the damage they've done. Yeah, good to know. Look at these wrecks. It appears as though the facility's automated security has already been dealt with. Not good. Is this the Brotherhood of Steel's handiwork? Unfortunately, no. Look oh, at the no. evidence. There isn't a single spent ammunition casing or drop of blood in sight. These robots were assaulted by Institute Synths. Uh, okay. It sounds like you're scared of Synths. There's a measurable difference between being frightened and being prepared. Now, let's move out. So, Synths. So here are uh, this shit place is a mess, of robots. But I still see a few pieces of salvage that the Brotherhood might be interested in. After we're done here, I'll have to mark this place for sweep and retrieve. I will let you go first. You're the big guy. Looks like a dead end. See if you can find a way to get that door open. Um, I'm gonna reconnoiter the area. I will. I will simply hack the system. I did it. Secure. 
door to door controls and open doors. Oh my god, this is very good. Can I have your gun? Oh my god, the synths are great. Watch your footing. Looks like the power's out in this section. What the hell is this? This looks like a rocket part. Look at this place. Scribes have a field day in here. Uh -huh. The transmitter should be in the control room at the top of the core. It looks like the elevators are dead. We'll have to keep heading down for now and find a way to get the facility's power back online. There has to be a power backup system somewhere. Hopefully. Scout the maintenance area off of me. I'll remain here and watch our backs. Uh, great. Can you go and maybe get killed? There we go. Nice stuff. Okay, I need to unlock it. Mm, great. Will be short work. Password required. Now I can try again. shot me I won't take this gun it's not that good like I thought it would be 
Take it and I will throw something above. Because now I am like 10 over. Password was earned if it didn't change again. God, where is it? Oh, okay. Sure, or do. Restored. I don't think we're alone. Thermal engine fueled. Five. Command accepted. Oh. Commencing five second countdown. Nice. Five. Come more, five more. Institute four. More of you guys, please. Three. Ready to go. Two. Yeah, they are. Your end is near! Fire is upon you! Pretend you're hurt. Oh my god! Are you alright? Got cooked by those flames. But yeah. thanks to my power armor, I'm still in one piece. The important thing is that we're still alive. We have a way to get to the transmitter. Let's go. Great. Going down. Great, great. Where do I have to go actually? Get in! Okay, I'll stay up. Anyone here? Surface elevator to the surface. Great sentence, great sentence of man. Okay. Going up. Go up, finally. Yeah. 
smoother? I thought we did fine. That sweet was slop. We were caught unprepared more than once, which is unacceptable. However, your extra gun gave us the edge we needed. I'm not certain I could have accomplished the mission alone. Yeah, because we are amazing. I thought we worked well as a team. Agreed. It's a refreshing change to work with a civilian who can follow orders properly. That being said, I believe we have two important matters to discuss. First wow. and foremost, if you'll hand me the deep range transmitter, I'd like to compensate you for your assistance during this operation. I think you'll find this weapon useful. Ooh, it's my what own personal toy. modification of the standard Brotherhood laser rifle. May it serve you well in battle. Oh my god. I take it. Thank you. You're welcome, civilian. Now, don't call me civilian, call me boss. I wanted to make you a proposal. We had a lot thrown at us back there. Our op could have ended in disaster, but you kept your cool and handled it like a soldier. There's no doubt in my mind that you've got what it takes. The way I see it, you've got a choice. You could spend the rest of your life wandering from place to place, trading an extra hand for a meager reward. Mm. Or you could join the Brotherhood of Steel. I have Make steel. Your mark on the world. So, what do you say? We joined the Brotherhood, though, and we... Uh, agree. I'd be honored to join. That's what I wanted to hear. Meet me back at the police station, and we'll discuss the details. Yeah, now we can fuck up this other guy. Oh my god, how much we got for this mission. Mutants, huh? You're our kind of guy. Ah, so great. Very great. What do you mean you can't open the gate? Stop playing around, Danny. I'm standing out in the open here for crying out loud. I got orders not to let you in, Miss Piper. I'm sorry. I'm just doing my job. What the fuck? Ooh, just doing your job. Protecting Diamond City means keeping me out, is that it? <laughs> oh, look, it's the scary reporter. <gasps> I'm sorry, but Mayor oh. McDonough's really steamed, Piper. Saying that article you wrote was all lies. Uh -huh. The whole city's in a tizzy. She will be our new bitch. <sighs> you open this gate right now, Danny Sullivan. I live here. You can't just lock me out. <sighs> How it seems he can lock you open out. Open yes. this gate right now. Huh. You. You want into Diamond City, right? Nah. Uh, I just uh, got here, but yeah. Shh. Okay. 
What? What's that? You said you're a trader up from Quincy? You have enough supplies to keep the general store stocked for a whole month? Wow. <laughs> you hear that, Danny? You gonna open the gate and let us in, or are you gonna be the one talking to crazy Myrna about losing out on all the supply? Jeez, all right. I have a shitload of supplies. Longer. Give me a minute. Better head inside quick before old Danny catches on to the bluff. I have much to give. You first. Wouldn't have it any other way. She will be our bitch. This is my lady. Piper, who let you back inside? I told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. You devious, rabble-rousing slanderer. Uh. The level of dishonesty in that paper of yours. I'll have that printer scrapped for parts. Wait a second. I had to say for a second, because... Ooh, that a statement, Mr. McDonough? Time to shut down the... Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I thought I can shoot him. I'm sorry. Live and love. This is me in the background. Beware. <laughs> okay. Ooh, that a statement, Mr. McDonough? Tyrant Mayor shuts down the press. Why don't we ask the newcomer? You support the news? Because the mayor's threatening oh, to throw free now speech the in the dumpster. Again. Hmm. Always believed in freedom of the press. Oh, I didn't mean to bring you into this argument, good sir. No, no, no. You look like Diamond City material. I Welcome to the great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Safe, happy, a fine place to come. Spend your money, settle down. Don't let this muckraker here tell you otherwise, all right? Oh, what should we do now? Sounds great, whatever. You're full of it. This yeah. hasn't been the friendliest welcome. He's got you there, McDonough. Guess not everyone gets won over by that shark smile of yours. <laughs> now, was there anything particular you came to our city for? Yeah. Mm. I'm, missing I'm trying to find someone. Trying to find someone? Who? My son. My son, Sean. He's less than a year old. Wait, your son's missing? Oh, you hear that, McDonough? What's Diamond City Security doing to help this man, huh? This isn't the first missing persons report to come through here, and now we have an infant who's been taken? Uh, don't listen to her. Well, what? I'm afraid that our security team can't follow every case that comes through. I'm confident that you can find help here. This is Diamond weird. City has every conceivable service known to man. One of our great citizens can surely find the time to help you. Who can well, help? sure. And a mayor of a great city must know everyone. Who can help me? Oh, I'm sorry. I don't have time for any more questions. I'm a busy man. Enjoy your stay in our fair city. Really? This is ridiculous. Diamond City Security can't spare one officer to help. I want the truth, McDonough. What's the real reason security never investigates any kidnappings? I've had enough of this, Piper. This is From now question. on, consider you and that little sister of yours on notice. Yeah, keep talking, McDonough. That's all you're good for. Right. Hmm, a big Diamond City welcome from the mayor. You feel honored yet? I feel honored. Look, I gotta go get settled in, but, um, stop by my office later. I have an idea for an article you'd be perfect for. I want your article. This one wrong. <laughs> Go to Piper's officer. Okay, so here we'll end finally the episode. We made it to Diamond City, where the girls are pretty. And, and yeah. So I hope you enjoyed this episode, and as always, stay positive, and we we'll see you in the next one. <laughs>